Hey y'all, I'm Moose. Welcome to my art journey and my live stream. I'm so glad you could be here with me today. It means a lot to me that you chose to be here. Thank you. Let's see who's here, shall we? I have my iPad right here and y'all have been just chatting away. I love it. Linda's here and Maria's here and Larry is here. Roxanne. Hello, you guys. Who else do I see? Brock is here. Hey, Brock. And I see y'all were talking a lot. Rochelle Rays is here. Shannon's here. Yay! Woo! Let's give it up in the chat for my moderator, Shannon. Claps in the chat for Shannon. Yay! And Brian's here. Hey, Brian. And who else do I see? Tomo's here. Hey, Tomo. Julia Lee's here. Bonnie's here. Donna's here. Deirdre Cheek is here. Doris is here. Woohoo! Give it up in the chat for Doris. I love my moderators. They're so awesome. Who else do I see? Did I miss anybody? Bonnie's Fluid Creations Art. Jane is here. Hey, Jane. And Julia Lee, I see you've changed your channel name to Creative Roads Art by Julia Lee. I like that. What else do we have going here? There's Tomo. Jeanette White, thank you. Hi from England. Hello from Rochester, Washington, USA. And let's see. That's all I see. If I missed you, I'm terribly sorry. I will give you a special hello right now. Hello and thank you for being here. Say hi in the chat. We'll all say hi back. Okay, this is fun. Um, today we're going to do some fun stuff. First, we're going to do show and tell, so let me get that. My tray's not as heavy as it was last week, but it will be even heavier next week because I got lots to show you. First, I want to show you that I got my Scotty dog from Doris. Isn't he adorable? He is so pretty. I love the turquoise. I love the gold and the shimmer. Thank you so much, Doris. I love him. He sits over here next to Old Monroe. Which I don't think y'all can see, the, but the top of Old Monroe's head. <laughs> Let's see. We had our Halloween tree swipe, video number 678. It turned out really pretty. I love it. I love the brown. I love the gold. I love the orange and the purple. I'm trying to get close to the... There, you can see that. <laughs> I don't want to mess up the other cameras. But... Yes, 678. Loved that one. And then this one was video 677. However, it was the very first tree swipe that I tried to do. And I did it on a black and white split base. And it went really dark. But there you can see it. That looks so cool. keep bumping the overhead camera. Shame for shame. Then we had this one on the oval, the Witcher tree. I think it has a very Tim Burton-esque Burton -esque likeness to it. <laughs> Video number 680. So let me get close to this camera so you can see it. Uh, 
I love the way the knot came out. I'm trying to get that in the light for you. Yeah, <laughs> let's try the overhead camera. Turn it around so it's right side up for you. There we go. I love all the color that's in the branches. There's the purple and the orange and the brown. And then there's gold in the tree. There's that knot. I love it. Love it, love it, love it. And what I did was I dipped a large cabochon in um, excess paint and I got that. Isn't it pretty? Let's have a big cabochon to set now. Okay. Let me switch things around here and then I'll show you what we did Saturday last week. We did the witch, and she didn't want to stay put, <laughs> so everything kind of slid sideways. So you can see here where the black slid, the color slid onto the cat. So I'm not real sure what I want to do with her. I might keep her the way she is and mount her on a background. But I like the broom. It came out really well. <laughs> Deb was trying to help me with some light there, I think. And then we did a, I think it was a flip cup, wasn't it? Look at that. Look how pretty. <laughs> Turquoise and orange and gold and purple. Gorgeous, 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 gorgeous. I love it. Robin Lossie's here. Hey, Robin. Susan's here. Hey, Susan. And then, real quick, we did a um, airbrushed sort of flower. Then I spun it out on this little pumpkin right here. And it turned out so pretty. And it's very shiny because I use Liquitex gloss medium. And I didn't have any Floetrol in my paints. It's textured, but I think that's really cool. Thank you. Thank you, guys. Okay. Let me try to put these back the way they need to be so I can move them without hitting the camera. Easy. There we go. Okay. Have I missed anybody in the chat? I'm looking at the chat. Do I see anybody that I haven't said a hi to? If I haven't said hi to you, say hi to me so I can say hi back. <laughs> Are we having fun? I want that's that's what I want is I want y'all to have fun. Okay. Let's look at our color palette now. Um, my color palette matches the thumbnail for today's live. So this is, that's where I got this color palette was I found, um, the picture on Pinterest. So we have Arteza Burnt Sienna. And... TLP, Aphrodite, and 
and then we have a custom medium orange. And this is, I'm going to try to pronounce this. It's T-O-P and it's E-C-H-E-V-E-R-I-A. A Echeveria, I think. Somebody please correct me if they know the pronunciation of that word. But that's a beautiful green color. And then we have a TLP sequins, which is a really beautiful uh, color shift from green to uh, lavender, which, you know, those are my two favorite colors, so we can't miss with this one. Then we'll put in some Deco Art 24 karat gold. Then I have a custom here that I made with TLP Twinkle and um, Black Diamond. Um, Black Diamond Purple Galaxy. So there's like this purple glitter in here that I don't know if I can get you to see it. But it's pretty too. Trust me. Okay, then we have TLP asparagus that I've added just a touch of uh, TLP submarine to it to brighten it up just a little bit. Joy E's here. Hey, Joy E. Mel's here. Hey, Mel. Roxanne Sexton, did I say hello to you yet? I love Aphrodite too, it's beautiful. And this one is, what is this? Agapanthus from TLP. And then the last one from TLP is Afterglow. Nice bright pink to add to our palette to brighten things up. All right, and that's our palette. I'm going to do, first I'm going to do a swipe on a black background with that palette. We'll have that on a 10 by 10 canvas right here. And then we're going to try to make it look like a burst of color. That's, that's the attempt. So we'll, we'll try that. Okay, let me put my gloves on. Time for struggle cam. <laughs> struggle cam. <laughs> oh, that one went on easy. And then we'll try to get this one on just as easy. Where's the thumb? On the other side. Are we having fun? I'm having fun. All right. Okay. Um, 10 by 10 inch canvas here. And um, we're going to put down some black. Oh, my Bonnie, my nails kind of act like shoehorns. This is Montmartre Black, and it is mixed with GAC 800 Liquitex uh, Gloss Medium and uh, Floetrol. My TLP colors do not have Floetrol in them because I ran out of Floetrol. <laughs> Supposed to be getting some more today. I thin down my black so it should be nice and fluid. All right. 
right. I may spin this, Brock. Tell Nat. Unless she's at her grandparents. Okay. Let me get the sides. Because I don't want white sides on my black painting. So, let's see, what can we talk about? Oh, got to hold my grandbaby. I'm so happy. I might, I don't know if I get to hold him again tomorrow or not. They're going to come by for a quick minute. So, I don't know if he'll be with them. Aren't grandbabies the best, those of y'all that have them? side and then we'll torch it okay I should have painted my canvas before I started today with <clears throat> just the edges to keep that lightness from happening but hopefully with the swipe it will rectify itself okay now we need a torch and I am going to put just a little bit more black over here on this corner side. Oh heck, why not all sides? Because it's light on all sides. Okay. Fun time. Color time. Yay! Doris has got everything set up. Okay. Uh, first things first, we're going to put down some Arteza Burnt Sienna. I need to find my center. So let me get my little piece of string here. This is the easiest way to find your center on a square canvas. It's with a piece of string. You can go from corner to corner across the middle. There we go. Okay. Now burnt sienna. Right here in the middle. And then some... I've already forgotten what color this is. Aphrodite. So remember, we're going to swipe out from the center. And then some custom medium orange. Some Echeveria. Echeveria. I don't know how to say it. And some sequins. Hello, Doris. 
24 karat gold. My custom twinkling purple galaxy, if I can get it to stay mixed up long enough. Nathan's here. Hey, Nathan. Thank you for joining us, hon. Do, are you going to have a premiere tonight, Nathan? This is the asparagus with a little of the, um, what did I say, submarine mixed in. And some agapanthus. I'm going to have a big puddle of paint here for swiping. <laughs> and some afterglow. Maybe I should have used a bigger canvas. I thought about doing a 14 by 14, but changed my mind at the last minute. Okay. We're going to use Amsterdam Titanium White mixed with Australian Floetrol as our swipe color. And I'm just going to put some down here on the pee pad so I can dip into it. Let me torch this puddle of paint. And I just threw something onto the painting. Let's get that out. All right. Okay, here we go. We'll put this down in some titanium white. This is just a little plastic piece of uh, acetate that I have that I just cut out a piece. And we will swipe. That's pretty. This will do the four centers first. And then we'll do the corners. One more side. All right. How's our first swipe doing? Kind of scrunching up and getting skinny. Let's go to the corners. Well, what are we thinking so far? Is it going to be a, a good one? Is it going to look smashing? It's going to be different, and y'all know I like different.
one more corner. Okay, now I'm going to sneeze, excuse me, going to sneeze, Lisa B's here, hey Lisa B, and Nathan, I'm sorry, I asked you a question and then I didn't look to see if you answered, if you were going to have a premiere tonight, tomorrow? Awesome sauce. Okay, uh, now we need a smaller piece of our plastic. So, I've got a piece of plastic here. I'm just gonna cut some off. Now I have a little piece of plastic. I need some more white. our swipe color and then let's swipe here we're going to try to make this look like a starburst i think i swiped that one too fast sneezing is a part of painting <laughs> Thank you, Doris. <laughs> These are squeezing down into just a single line almost. I'm going to spin this so we can see what happens to it. I think I'm swiping too fast. I need to slow down. Y'all aren't in a hurry, are you? Sonia's here. Hey, Sonia. That one did a little better. So my color doesn't seem to be getting dragged out, drug out to the uh, edges but I really like what's going on in the center. I think I'm pulling this one too fast too. Oh, you missed the spooky music. Jeff B's here. Hail, Jeff B. You didn't miss too much. I did show and tell, and I'm working on my first painting. Let's see. That's looking pretty cool. What are we thinking? What do y'all think? Enter the chat at your own risk. <laughs> I like the way the color looks between the, the spokes of this burst, and I like the way the center looks. Shall we give it a little spin and see what happens to it? Okay, 
Let's loosen up our cake break. And we'll give it a spin. Baby spins, yes. I actually like it the way it is. And I think if I spin it too much more, I'm gonna lose some of this lacing. You too, Shannon. I don't know if you're talking to me or not. <laughs> A sea urchin dub says, I like it. Let me lift it up to the camera. The pink is very subtle. So is the purple. It does look like mother of pearl, doesn't it? I like it. It's cool. Thank you, Donna. Set it over here where it can rest. And wipe off my hands and check the chat. Let's see what's going on over here in the chat. Why are we wrapping Sonya in bubble wrap? Oh, y'all are just bopping and wrapping each other over. Okay. Starfish or bottom of view of squid. <laughs> I like that, Jeff. Perfect, Nathan says. Pretty, Roxanne says. Cool, Donna says. Thank you so much, guys. I love it that y'all are playing in the chat, too. Thank you, Jeff. No pow pow, Linda. <laughs> okay, let me wipe this off. And then, because I honestly don't want to struggle fighting with another one. Because y'all get struggle cam when I put my gloves on. You don't need struggle cam when I'm trying to put on my Whatever that thing is, shower cap. Oh, Doris, I watched your live the other day, your Tuesday live, and I saw where Molly came in and she was uh, talking about the um, silicone mat for the cake spinners, and I got one. So I will let you guys know um, how I like it once I get to play with it. I just got it in today, so it was like I didn't have time to get it open and get it in here. I mean, it came in just before the live started. So, okay, next canvas is an 11 by 14 inch level two gallery wrapped canvas. I think I got all the black off my fingers. And we're going to do a split cup pour with this palette. Fun! Okay. Awesome sauce. Here we go. Here's some split cup. I like this one. It's got a handle on it. Now, let's see. I was thinking with my color palette, I would put... Huh. Okay, I remember I was going to put sequins and my other one, my twinkle, on the outside. It's going to be a lot of sequins. I have a load of Christmas music all ready to go. Awesome sauce. Let's see, and this is the 
Twinkle and Purple Galaxy. Then let's put in, let's do the greens, of course. So this Echeveria, Echeveria, I don't know how to pronounce it. We'll put a little of that in there. And then we'll put some asparagus in there. And some more of this one I can't pronounce. Okay. Then I'm going to put in some Aphrodite. And some Afterglow. And some Agapanthus. Okay. I have not put in any gold or uh, burnt sienna, and I don't think I'm going to. I don't think I'm going to do the orange either. I need a little bit more in there. So let's shoot some gold down in that. See how that looks. And then let's pour this. I'm going to do a traveling split cup pour. Tuck Shannon water balloon. Now y'all don't get the studio all messy. <laughs> mud? Sonia, where did you get mud? Yellow snow? Come on, guys. <laughs> no, Linda. <laughs> okay, here we go. We're pouring. I'm concentrating very hard. Here comes some of that afterglow. Oh, that afterglow and the Aphrodite look so pretty together. Okay, that won't fit down in there. <laughs> Ooh, look at this pretty palette. 
too cool for school, Bonnie says. Thank you. Let's torch it. Now, shall we wreck it? With something? With a chain, maybe? Or just tilt it? I'm looking at the chat. What do y'all think? Mo's here. Hey, Mo. Shannon says wreck it. <laughs> Might as well the girls break the chat. Okay, let me get a chain. And I think I'm about to spill over. I got the hiccups. Spill over over here. Turn this around so it will go the other way. And we will just kind of lay a, ooh, shall I lay it in a spiral? And No. Ooh, so many decisions. All right, here goes the chain. It's in. It's going to happen, whether we like it or not. I think there's too much paint on here for this. Yeah. Okay. Not the best idea in the world. But that's all right. You don't know until you try. Put that down in my water. And now let's tilt. This corner. Got rid of most of that gold. Let's go to this corner. It's getting very cloudy looking, which I like, kind of ethereal. I'm liking what I'm seeing. Back to the center. I really like this palette. This is pretty. Look at that, y'all. Feels like Easter. Feels like Easter. <laughs> Be probably because of the purple and the pink. I'm wiping the edges. Looks great, Doris says. Yeah, it does have some interest from the chain, so not wasn't a total loss or fail. Let me fix these corners real quick. Then I'll spring it up for a close-up for you guys. There we go. Okay. Let me wipe off my fingers. Because I don't want it to slip out of my hands. Thank you, Bonnie. KL Artistic is here. Hey, Carrie. Thank you.
I'm looking at the chat. I'll lift this up in just a second. Getting all my fingers dried off. Thank you, Roxanne. Okay. Let's lift this up for you guys to see. We'll go from this corner. It's very soft and cloudy looking. I like it very much. Okay, there's the other camera. Let me do this corner. I think it's too close to the camera. <laughs> Y'all don't know how nervous she makes me when she does this. <laughs> I have three cameras that I'm trying to avoid when showing you guys close ups. All right, let's set this aside. We have 15 minutes left. I think that's um, plenty of time to chat for a minute, get cleaned up so we can get ready for Doris's live. She's going to do some pretty stuff too today. And I have you guys redirected to her, so you should just be able to automatically go over to her live when our live stops. So, what shall we talk about while I clean up? Thank you, Doris. I really like those colors. Give Dub's heart a break. <laughs> He's my rock, that's for sure. We don't need him having a heart attack. You saw a face in the corner, Brock? Yes, I saw Dub's magic from last week. I thought it was really good. I hope you guys enjoyed it. I thought that was fun. I think um, my favorite is the purple one, the purple ghost. All right. Brock sent dubs a pick. Okay. <laughs> okay. Well, guys, I'm going to let y'all go. Um, this was so much fun today. I do appreciate y'all being here with me and it means very, very much to me. Mwah, mwah, mwah. I love you all. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. It was so much fun. I hope I got to say hi to everybody. If I missed you, I'm sorry. Special hello for you right now. Hello and thank you for being here. I hope you had fun. I had fun. Let's continue the fun over at Doris's at DF Designs. So thank you. Have a lovely day. And until we meet again, enjoy your journey. Bye, y'all.